creation and has spawned over 20 seasons of TV, 18 movies, and 122 video games. And with each new addition to the franchise, we also get new Pokemon to add to our Pokedex. Most of the time, the latest pocket monsters are cute and memorable, like Pikachu, but with so many Pokemon out there, there's bound to be some undesirable ones. So these are our picks of the five Pokemon whose designs have fans wondering, what are they thinking? Probopass is a fourth generation Pokemon who made its debut in the 11th season of the show. And since we set our eyes on it, we can't help but wonder why. Why is its nose disproportional to the rest of its body? Why does it have a mustache? Why are there three duck heads attached to its body? And why does it kind of look like Mario? But what's most disappointing about this Pokemon is knowing that its pre-evolution form, even though it isn't the best, is so much better than this. This next Pokemon is such straight trash, it's literally categorized as a trash heap. That's right, Garbodor is a poison type Pokemon whose biological makeup is actual garbage. Although it has an adorable dopey personality, the stench of its design makes it hard to truly love it. Garbodor's face is a garbage bag and the rest of its body is a result of the bag ripping and spilling trash everywhere. We hate when this happens in real life, so it's hard to imagine any Pokemon trainer wanting to cuddle up to this smelly creature. Palosan is a rare ghost ground Pokemon who first made its appearance in Pokemon Sun and Moon. Unlike the other Pokemon on our list, this one is terrifying. Palosan has the ability to suck the life source of other Pokemon, and although that's more than enough to keep your distance, its awful design doesn't make you want to be close to it as well. Taking the shape of a generic sandcastle, it's unsettling to see the childhood memory of building a sandcastle be tainted by the monster that is Palosan. With over 800 Pokemon in the Pokedex, there has to be a point where the creators were running out of ideas, and no other Pokemon is more of an indication of this happening than Klefki. We aren't sure if the designer was just under a strict deadline and looked for inspiration from the first thing they grabbed from their pocket, but it sure seems like it. One of the more frustrating things about the design is the fact that the keys on Klefki don't match. Come on, you couldn't do that at least? The last thing that you want to think of when choosing a Pokemon is if you want to eat it. No one wants to eat their best friend, but unfortunately for Vanillax, that's all you can think of when looking at it. Let's make it clear, Pokemon are not food, so we'd appreciate it if they didn't look like our favorite dessert. We just can't believe someone thought this evolution form is better than its base form of one scoop of ice cream. That gives us brain freeze. We choose to pass on catching these poorly designed Pokemon, but let us know what you think on our socials at Squad State.